welcome back to my channel. We are doing a weekend in my life. It's Friday night. I'm here with Ryan. What's up, everybody? Ryan Claus. And I was like, wait, why am I not vlogging this? We're doing our Christmas gift exchange. We need to go show them what you got me. Yeah. I'm so obsessed. He got me so thoughtful. I've been collecting matches. They looked like I had a lot more in that vase. Um, and he got me this beautiful match book frame thing. Like it's literally made for that, right? So we put the ones I had already and I was like, wow. Gotta get some more. Gotta go on some more dates. Yep. So thank you so much, this is so lovely. I actually am kind of vibing with how this looks leaned up against or once I like fill it up more to hang it up. But what's awesome about it is you can open it up and add as you go so it's not like you have to close it and then hang it up for good. It's like a continuation. So this will really, really inspire me to go get more and it was really helpful. Thanks, Ryan. All right. So I want you to open the thing that's like wrapped first. This? Yeah. It's nothing crazy, but I just think it's funny. Are these egg boxes? They're boxers? egg boxers. I love them. <laughs> this is great. They're eggs on pans. If you guys don't know, Ryan's a big egg flipper. Oh, yeah. Yay! They've already seen everything in this bag, so I'm gonna close it out, but okay. I just got them closed, you guys know. <laughs> oh my gosh, so I got him this shirt, the flannel, and the jacket. A little layering moment, what do you think? I love it. I love this look on you, Ryan. It's very <laughs> all-American. Ryan just left, I'm just starting the dishwasher, doing a little bit more tidying up because my family just landed in New York City. I'm so happy. We have our second New York City Gals on the Go live show tomorrow at Gramercy Theater, sold out again, so crazy. Um, and my family wasn't able to come to last weekend, but they made a trip out of it and came this weekend because my mom was gonna come last weekend and then she was like, wait, your brother will be back for the second weekend from college, from finals, and my dad was off this weekend Lo and behold, they booked a flight and I'm so excited to have them here. It was definitely like last weekend seeing Brooks family there. I was like, oh, like I'm so excited to have my family here. It's obviously so nice. Like growing up, they would come to all of my musicals and my dance recitals and plays and everything. So I'm definitely like, I'm like really excited to have them here. And it's Christmas in New York City. My brother has not been to New York City since the first time I was ever in New York City, which I think he was like 10 and I was 12. Um, so big, big, big weekend. So he's only been in New York City once. He never got to see, see my last apartment because of college and sports and everything. But he's really excited for this weekend too. Like I'm so excited for a ton of you guys that are coming to the show to like meet him and my family. They're gonna be selling merch tomorrow. I'm just so excited. And then, so, so tomorrow's the show. Today's Friday, tomorrow's the show, Saturday. And then Sunday, I have like a whole day planned because we won't be focus on the live show anymore. We're gonna go see the Rockefeller tree. I've been waiting till they came so he could go see the tree and other Christmassy things like Fifth Ave, Central Park. And also just like, I want my brother to see my apartment and then we're gonna go to the Comedy Cellar. I haven't been to the Comedy Cellar since September, which is actually, it's been a minute. So I'm excited. Maybe I won't have the jokes memorized this time. But yeah, anyways, I honestly spent the whole entire day cleaning. One life hack, I share this a lot to have a clean apartment is every now and then have visitors because I, I don't know, I personally just feel way more pressured, especially when it's my mom or my dad. They're like, oh my God, the dust. Like my mom's really chill, but she's like, dude, you gotta clean this. Like not good for the atmosphere. So I did a full deep clean and it's just nice. It's just motivation. Like my hallway's been really, really messy. I cleaned it up. Um, my dad's gonna help me hang up. I've Finally, I'm help, having helped hang up this mirror. Ryan could have helped, I could have done it, I don't know. My dad was just like, save it for me, I'll do it. Like, my dad just likes to have things to do when he comes. I don't know if anyone else's dad is like that. I also realized I had this little vase, not vase, I don't know, pot planter thing. And so I put my umbrella, it was a rainy day, I put my umbrella in there. Um, I think that's creative. It's It was open, because I was like letting it dry, but I'll close it and put all my umbrellas in there. It's nice and clear here for my mirror selfies. My shelves are starting to fill up. I'm like so obsessed with this. And in here, I have my door closed just to keep the humidifier going. What did I do in here? Oh, I had a pile of clothes over here. And I was like, my mom's coming and she's gonna make fun of me. So it motivated me to put my laundry away. I also got this new hanger from the container store earlier today. So I could see all of my robes rather than one hook and it like basically is falling off. 
I put some fresh flowers in the bathroom. Well, Ryan got me these for the show last weekend and I had them out there, but I thought it would look nice in the bathroom. My, my mom like loves a nice bathroom. I also got this at the container store today too. I put my floss in there. So I'm just excited for my family to see my apartment. My dad saw my apartment when it was empty, um, but he didn't get to see it all moved in. My mom was here when I moved in, so she saw a lot of it, but I'm just excited. My brother's just never seen it at all. So I'm just really, I'm like giddy, I'm excited. I just got word my family is in a taxi and they are en route to my apartment. I'm so excited. Oh, hey, there's Freddie. <laughs> Hello. They made it and Freddie already raided my fridge and took a ginger shot. This one's strong with the cayenne. Yeah, it's got, that's a good one. Dad, what do you have to say to the vlog? Hey, girls. <laughs> I love I with the hand. Girls. He changes it up. My mom brought me this really cute ornament. Oh. From Florida to put on the tree. It's so cute. All right, the boys just left. We all chatted in the living room for a little bit. My mom's here. My mom's sleeping here, and my dad and brother are staying at a hotel. I don't know if I said that, but I'm just making us some sleepy time tea. Big day tomorrow. It feels like Christmas Eve. Good night, guys. Good morning. <laughs> from our eye patches and pink PJs. I love Today's the day. Hmm. Play cozy Christmas jazz. She is me, I am her. Good morning from NYC. Hashtag. <laughs> Our pile of eye patches. <laughs> That's cute. Dad is here and my boar bristle brush broke. That's a tongue twister, boar bristle brush broke. So he goes, do you have a glue? I love your shirt too, Dad, very festive. We're getting ready to go to brunch. He came here to have some coffee with my ember mug. Um, this is my little outfit. We're going to market table. I've never been. Freddy's at the hotel. He's gonna meet us. Um, wearing my Anine Bing sweat set. Gonna put on some shoes and a jacket and some sunglasses because it's actually sunny outside. So yeah, this is kind of like today's activity brunch and like walk around the neighborhood and then get ready for the live show. We are that stereotypical like tourist family right now. Like we're taking up the whole sidewalk and they're all like but he's like, what's everyone in a rush to go to? Like, it's a Saturday morning. I'm like, it's New York, baby. Everyone's going somewhere. Oh my gosh, they all look so good. Yum. This is it. Brian has met up with us now. He's wearing his new outfits. Holiday market. It's really crowded today. I'm just gonna walk around a little bit more with them, and then I'm gonna go back and, as Freddie says, lock Somebody in. Somebody called me an MIT grad. Oh yeah. I'm not. My GPA does not reflect that. Oh. It's not about school. It's about what you do after school. The guys here at the park always try to get people to play chess with them. I really wish I knew how to play chess. Yeah, Freddie was like, I wish I could play chess, and he was like, Take You look like money. an MIT grad, and Freddie was like, Thank you. Brooke just sent me this as a hype song. So the fam is still out. I'm lighting my candle. And I honestly could have kept walking and like showing them around, but I was like, let me not exert all this energy and just come back. I was planning on coming back in like 30 minutes, but I was like, we're right by my apartment now. Let me just go back 
I need to take a shower because Mads is doing our hair there. Needs us to have wet hair, but like she re-wets it too. Um, but I, I kind of want to do like this brightening hair mask and then like rinse it off and do all that. Anyways, I was just like, let me just have a moment to myself before they come back here and everything. I'm going to the theater two hours before them um, and Ryan's with them right now, which is awesome. So he's like showing them around and everything. So, and they were like, yes, go charge your social battery, all the things. So I'm gonna take a shower, I just left the candles, I'm gonna play some good music, just like chill vibes. My Aunt Debbie's taking the train in from Long Island, she'll be here in about 45 minutes, so. Before I take a shower, I just pulled these things out from the fridge. They're like little cryo globes, or they're not globes, these are like more of a spoon shape. I like these better, I had ones that are globes. But these I really like, because they're almost like a spoon, so you can really like get in there, and I actually, have been putting them in my refrigerator rather than freezer because the freezer was making them like too cold. Oh my God, this feels so, so good. I'm just trying to do all the self-care things today. Feeling fresh in my robe. I just showered, got my slippers on. It's about to happen. We're about to get started with the day. My Aunt Debbie said she's like pulling up right now. I love looking out. Oh my God, there she literally is. Oh my God. Icon. Legend. Go, Aunt Debbie, go. <laughs> She's probably calling me right now to let me know. I'm gonna let her in. Look at her. <laughs> I timed that perfectly, unlocking it for her. Here she comes. Hello! Oh my god, you look amazing. Really? Oh my god, you look so good! Thank you, I needed Yay. that because I'm having fun. Oh my god, I'm not you gonna look, say anything. Don't you look fabulous. No, oh, really? I'm obsessed. Why? I don't know. Your hair? Did you color it? Yesterday, yeah. It looks so good. Yeah, Welcome. but you know, I was up half the night, my eye hurts. Oh. Whole fam's here, we're steaming, we're doing things, we're we're hair gelling. Oh, that's a nice steam. Thank you. All right, it's time. I'm leaving all of them. I'm going to get my hair and makeup done, and then they will be coming in about two hours. What is it about? I don't understand why you're home. That's so sweet. We love Phil. Phil's our stagehand. That is such a vibe. Such it's like vibe. he knew. It's such a moment. Oh my god, and you wore your white one and I wore I my know. pink one. Oh, look at us guys. Our back, she forgot to give you her backstage pass. Oh yeah, they said that I got here before the employees. Oh I really god. just beat them to it. Um, thanks, it. backstage access. Oh yeah. So this is where we're going to be selling merch. And this is also where the meet and greet happens. One of the bars. And then this is backstage. These curtains will be closed. Emma's here. Hello, hello. And then we go up here and the stage is up there. So good, cat slayed. We've got the food spread, we've got Joe's pizza, my family's about to arrive. I can't believe Adina sent us this cake. How iconic, we're gonna take cool photos with that. Cheese board from Happy Boards, Emma got us some veggies from Whole Foods. And then back here, this is where we're selling the merch. So fun, we have limited supplies because last weekend a lot of people bought stuff. The drink menu, so good. Can we take a moment for the drink menu? There's my dad, he's getting patted down. Oh my god, this, is this for Brooke and I? Yes. That's really sweet. Uh, <laughs> I needed this calming energy. I know. <laughs> I don't know how to work today. Hey, getting ready. Hey. Yes. The drink delivery. Oh my god, with the shot. Thank you so much. God bless you, I know. Thank you, I'm gonna grab it from you. I just, it's got extra bubbles. I need extra bubbles. I love it. I love it. <laughs> oh, she's gonna eat it up. Oh, that's so cute. Not as much as Oh, no, no one's gonna eat up as much as Adina did. All right. 
You'll take a big sip while I take yes, a shot. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, wait, I need to get baby carrots. Hold on. There you go. Yeah. 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 Let's get it. Oh, my God. Is this soap cat? If it's still rubbed in the ground. Okay, we're watching the last kick in the World yes. Cup. We're cheering on Argentina because growing up, Freddie was a big fan of Messi. This is, could be Messi. It is Messi's last World Cup, right? Yes. Um, Probably. The next one's in four years. Come on, come on, you got it. You got it right now. Oh! Yeah! I'm like not a soccer fan either, but this is just so sweet. Oh, oh they're all laying down. Oh. They haven't shown Lionel Messi. Where is he? They all like hug. It's adorable. It's so different than football. Yeah, well, they all hug too. It's just a different. They're all in like different piles. Yeah, they're like in different <laughs> piles on the field. Hi, guys. <laughs> Happy Sunday. I. I can't believe we just did two shows at the Gramercy Theater, sold out, so much fun. Last night was just as much fun, and it was just like a different kind of fun. It was a whole new audience, my family was there, it was just seriously so special. So to any of you guys that were there last night, like, thank you so much. Last night, so many people brought their boyfriends, their husbands, their fiancés. This one girl got engaged the night before our show, and they, like, came this weekend to New York for the show, like, from out of state. It was so crazy me and brooke were just seriously so grateful the photos turned out amazing madison killed it like everyone that was just a part of this team was just it was so special and it was so special to get to have my family there and ryan there and my aunt like so amazing so wow i like could i don't even think i vlogged after the show like i was we did the meet and greet and then we like did a little recap we did our post show notes because we the goal is to do more of these we'll be doing more of them wink and we want to like you know perfect the show basically so we're just kind of like oh like maybe we could do this instead or like end it like this stuff like that um and then went to bed woke up this morning and the world cup championship was on and i'm not a big soccer fan even though my brother like growing up i think it's because growing up i was like forced to go to all my brother's soccer games um and i don't know i think i just i don't know it's like a thing but Freddie and Ryan actually went to a bar this morning to watch the game because it was at 10 a.m. because it's in Qatar. Um, so I like slept in, woke up, my mom and dad and I had a lovely morning, drank coffee, just chatted. I, we're leaving tomorrow for Tampa. So I like slowly started to put things on this chair that I want to pack and like did laundry, I'm doing laundry, unbox it, like just prepping to leave while the game was on. And then the last half of the game was so intense and like so good. Um, we've always been a Messi fan. He's not always on Argentina, I guess just for the World Cup, but we were cheering on Argentina because this could be like, this probably was Messi's last World Cup because he's getting older. But yeah, so that was really fun. We ordered bagels. My parents were like, I need a New York bagel. And now it's, I mean, it's almost one o'clock. It's one o'clock right now. So I was like slowly getting ready. And now we're gonna head out and do our little touristy things today. Cause my brother, like again, hasn't been to New York since he was like 10. Um, and I haven't seen the Rockefeller Christmas tree yet. I was saving that for when my family was here. So I'm excited, that'll be really nice. And we'll probably see like the Saks Fifth Avenue light show. Well, actually it'll be during the day. I don't know if they do it during the day actually. We'll see. It does get dark at like four, so um, we'll feel that out. And then we have dinner reservations tonight at Rosemary's and then the Comedy Cellar. I'm so excited. I haven't been to the Comedy Cellar since before I moved to this apartment. So I'm due for a, another Comedy Cellar moment and my brother's never been. My mom and dad have been, but we're gonna go and Ryan's gonna join us. So yeah, I'm excited for a little festive day. We'll just kind of see where the day takes us. Ryan thankfully took Freddie on like a tour yesterday while I was getting ready for the show. So he took him to West Side Highway. Freddie saw the Statue of Liberty from afar and Ryan, Freddie's now like, I wanna move here, you know? Cause Ryan's given him the local experience, like, you know, the West Village vibe. So it's very sweet, it's very cute. But yeah, I'm gonna finish getting dressed. I thought I'd wear my green sweater today to be festive. And um, just enjoying this time with my family. It's been so lovely. But yeah, I just want to give that little intro before we get started with the day. Okay, I'm gonna go change. I'll show you guys my outfit and then we're gonna go. All right, here's the fit. Sweater is from Zara. Leggings are commando. They're kind of like the Spanx ones. Shoes are Steve Madden. And then we're just going 
Hopefully no one thinks I'm the Grinch. Yeah, yeah, I'm not the Grinch. I'm wearing green for Christmas. This I jacket is from me. Revolve. I will link it below. I will also link the leggings below because they're amazing. Sweat or scarf is from Free People, mainly for the fashion of it all. The vibes. And then bag is Bottega. Sunglasses are YSL. We're going to the tree, baby. So this is where the light show happens, but I don't know if they do it during the day. LPQ. Got lentil soup, some bread, so yeah. We are back now. We've been chilling out watching the Bucks game and I've been like packing and doing laundry because we're also flying out in the morning. My hair is still lasting from last night for the most part. Um, we had so much fun. We did all the Christmassy things. We got a snack at Lepa Quani Dot, LPQ, Quanti Dien. I don't know how to say it. Um, we are about to go to dinner at Rosemary's, which is a fabulous Italian restaurant. We actually haven't done like a family dinner <laughs> since them being here because of the show. And then after, we're going to Comedy Cellar, and some of my favorite comedians are gonna be there. One of them, which I DM'd, and I was like, I'm gonna be there tonight with my family, because he has this bit where he like took my green purse and like did a whole joke about it, and I'm like, I'll be there again so he could do the bit again. You know, I get it. Comedians need their content, right? I'm kidding, I'm not a comedian, I just go all the time. Here's my outfit. It's giving business, <laughs> but I just, I felt like my outfit needed this vest. I'm just wearing this like, you know, fun bib lettuce looking black turtleneck. All right, vest is from, oh my gosh, I forget the name of the brand. <laughs> it's on Revolve. I forget the name, I'm so sorry. Leggings are the same ones. And then I'm wearing my Steve Madden boots. And then I got this coat from Nasty Gal that I've been wanting to wear. It's this fun pink color and I'm wearing my green bag, so whatever. I think it'll still make it fun and bright and happy. I think this is so cute. I'm about to go to Florida and not get to dress like this, so I'm like, let me just full send before I go. And it buttons, I love it, I'm obsessed. Okay, on further thought, I don't think I can wear this coat. Uh, it's giving, I just can't. Nope, not it. All right, I went with this jacket instead from NAKD. It's just more of the vibe with the green bag, but I will be wearing that pink coat soon. Who's ready for Comedy Cellar? Woo! Ready to laugh a lot. Train ride. Ryan's going to Georgia tomorrow, I'm going to Florida. 
Freddie, how was your first Comedy Cellar experience? Extravagant. Extravagant? Yeah. So fun. Everyone have fun? I'm sleepy. I'm tired too. I only knew one set of the comedian's joke. I knew the whole set, but it's just one comedian out of five, so that's pretty good. Pretty good average for Tim. Usually I know all the jokes, because I come so often. I'm videoing right now. Uh, just got back from dinner in the comedy cellar. It was so much fun. We had the best time. My friend Harper left um, her jacket here last weekend, and so I left it with my doorman. She picked it up, and I get back, and my doorman's like, she actually left something for you. What could it, like, what? Harper, I didn't get you a gift. I'm sh oh my god, there's a card. Danny, wait, I'm gonna cry. What is this? I'm so confused. Oh my gosh, this card, that's epic. City girl. I always have the best time with you. You're such a great friend. I wanna get you a little something to add to your growing ornament collection. Congrats on your live shows. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, I am assuming this is an ornament from Bergdorf because that's the bag it was in. I was meaning last year I got an ornament from Bergdorf and I put it on my tree and I was like, I want to go every year and get an ornament from Bergdorf, but I didn't. I don't think she knows that, but oh my god, it's like a Cosmo. Harper, I'm going to cry. This is so thoughtful. Wait, let's go put it on the on the tree right now. All right, guys. I was gonna end the vlog tomorrow morning, but we're flying out in the morning, so I'm just gonna end the vlog now. And I'm gonna get ready for bed. I'm gonna enjoy my last evening in my apartment for like a week and a half, not that long. But I am so thankful to have my family here. I'm so thankful for all of your support on the live show, and I can't wait to do more. I love you guys so much. I'm like so sleepy. It's only 10 o'clock, but I'm like, woof. Thank you guys for watching this fun NYC with the fam vlog. And I will see you guys very soon for our next video. Bye.